guys how are you doing welcome and welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is me for me and today's video is going to be a try and haul actually a lot of try and haul basically i've got items for like four different four three different brands that i'm going to show you guys we've got from zara we've gone from boohoo we've got from basically beauty stores and then we've also got from um crocs rocks guys so yes guys without wasting time let's just jump right into the video let's just jump right into this video do not forget to subscribe give this video a thumbs up and um let me know what you guys think about all of these items in this haul we've got accessories mostly a couple of clothing items and yes guys I, I think we're gonna start off with zara after zara we're gonna go into the um beauty supply things then crocs and then boohoo i think you guys have seen or you guys would be seeing a lot of hauls i don't know how i'm going to post this or how i'm going to arrange it but i know i've got a sheen haul coming asus haul coming amazon haul coming this one and i've also got skims coming so you guys should let me know what you guys think about excuse me <clears throat> so you guys should let me know what you guys think about all of this hauls that i'm doing if you guys would want more hauls and how do you guys want your stuff i have shoes and bags and then i'm going to show you guys so first things first we've got a, <laughs> we've got a platform it was for 50 pounds 49.99 i got this in the size 41 this is what it looks like it's in this black suede color as you guys can see this is what it looks like i actually really do like it this with a satin skirt you're good to go this with a shot you're good to go like you can work it anyhow you want it honestly but we've just got this bad boy here as you guys can see i actually really really do like it a lot i haven't worn it so you guys should look for what to be styling it. So that's the first item we got from Zara. So the next item we have from Zara is a, a pair of this net ears. I got it for forty-six pounds. This is what it looks like, as you guys can see. Has just this little ear with a sling behind. It's actually quite different. I think like to an extent, I'm actually. I want to say transitioning into my grown woman era but i'm actually transitioning into a very different era like i'm kind of changing my style so so, so next then i'm looking forward to seeing what this new phase what this new transition has for me so that's why you're seeing this because I've, I've never owned anything like this before this is my first pair and honestly i can't wait to style it with a pair with a dress a satin skirt anything is gonna look good they actually had another style and then i i don't know why i didn't pick it it was more of a straw woven material i'll put up a picture so you guys see what i'm talking about but we've got this bad boy here and i can't wait to style it it's actually a mesh as you guys can see but this is the second shoe i got from zara the next item i have from zara is a bag is this um i don't even know the color to call it but it's just should i say stone color neutral vibe and all that actually really fell in love with it it comes in two colors they also have it in pink but it's like in this clothes material as you guys can see then it has this phrase underneath and here as the detailing is a shoulder bag and i love it honestly like you cannot go wrong with a pair of shoulder bags and mostly most of my shoulder bags have has been what has been coming with me on vacation inside has a side zip as you guys can see and this is just there it cost i think 29 pounds 30 quid i actually really do like it like i said it comes in the pink color like a bright pink i think i took a picture so i would show you guys what i put up a picture so you guys see what the pink one looks like but this is the color and the last item we've got from zara is this bag i actually really do like it it's coming off as some kind of dark gray i think but it's actually this blue color over the shoulder bag with adjustable straps you can 
make the straps shorter or longer on both sides and i got this one for 25.99 that's 26 pounds and it's like i said over the shoulder with silver detail it actually really really do like it the fact that it gives this either a gray or blue shade and i don't have something like this in my wardrobe and it has side pocket as you guys can see here it's got a side pocket it's magnetic nothing too much so that's this bag for you I actually really do like it there was another bag i wanted to get but when i saw the bag i think i did not come out with my purse or something like that so i could not buy it. and then by the time i checked online it was sold out online this is denim i put up a picture of it like two different shades of denim i was i was so pierced because i had the two different down one that had two different tones and then one i just had one tone i put up a picture so you guys see what i'm talking about so now that we're done with all of sarah we're just going to jump into the beauty supply thingies that i got from different shops i just kept everything in this bag it's quite a lot so we're gonna go through them really fast some are for the hair some are for the face so we're just going to go through it really fast first i got this air cream darks you guys know i use darks anyway so i just got this little one because i have in russia then i don't know if you guys are new to dr miracle i used it when i was younger in nigeria my mom always got and it was actually really expensive then but this is just an air cream and this is what it looks like um it has aloe vera, shea butter, and jojoba oil. Basically, this is just there. I got it for four pounds fifty. As you guys can see, I got it from the beauty supply store. The next thing we've got is this detoxifying pre-shampoo mix mist. Actually, is also Doctor Miracle. As you guys know, I kind of suffer from dry scalp, and now that we're already going to be in winter, I decided to get something just to avoid okay yeah, so i had issues with the other phone so yes like i was saying as you guys know i kind of have a dry scalp itch so this is just going to help ease it and make it less stressful i guess so it's a pre-shampoo mist you just put it on your hair before you shampoo it and all that so it's going to help with the dry scalp and flakes and everything then the next thing i think i got two of that yes i actually got two of that so next thing from the shop i got is this deep conditioner i got i didn't see like a bottle or a jar of it so i just got this one i've actually used this before before i made my hair um i used to one but i think you can use one twice depending on your hair or on how full your hair is but it's just this regular straight deep conditioner you leave it in your hair for like 15 to 20 minutes depending on if you're using like a steamer or you're just gonna push out kind of thing. so i got five and i think i have one more six probably in my toilet because like i said i bought it before but i bought two thinking one wasn't going to be enough and i used one i was actually you know too much so the next thing i got from the store is this olive anti tree dandruff oil treatments dry and itchy scalp care is this as i am brand i used the shampoo but now the shampoo is done i tried buying it but i didn't say so i said to get this one it's actually really good the shampoo was actually really good it helped with my dry scalp i got this for nine pounds eight pound ninety nine and this one of this was one pound so that's like about one pound fifty and the next thing i got is this hair mousse you guys know i make hair so it's just this wrap me foaming mousse you guys no good things about it i've heard good things about it so it's just this i got it for four pound fifteen then the next thing i got is my living conditioner dr miracle steel three pound fifteen the one i have a rush i think is finished so i just decided to re-up on it because i actually really do like it then the next thing i got is this solid shampoo and conditioner is in this ethic <laughs> it's in this ethic brand as you guys can see i think this is the shampoo and this is the conditioner for normal to dry hair is a conditioner of soap basically Ooh. fancy so this is what the shampoo looks it smells pretty good this is what the shampoo looks like like i said it's just a shampoo soap something different i just felt like to try it out 
and this is what it looks like this is the conditioner this is the soap and yes guys next thing i got you guys would have seen this before is my meta body i just decided to get a different flavor and this is the pure piece it smells heavenly i think i got it for like six pounds fifty i think it's gone up because last time i got it was like five pounds i got it from sainsbury's literally i can only find it in sainsbury they have the coconuts this one they have the green tea and then i have the another orange color so there is that the next thing i got cutting comb you can't go wrong with that. i think i have about two but this to be on the safe side i got another one then another thing i got is rinse off scalp balm head and shoulders replenishing boost with vitamin e this is what it looks like as you guys can see you put it on your hair and you rinse it apply to pre-washed hair and use the news applicator to focus I need to scarf on it for one to three minutes and rinse off. So this is just a from the Ed and Shoulder brand. I mean, I feel like you guys literally know it. Know the Ed and Shoulder brand. Then the next thing I have is this revitalizing mask from Nutrient Hair Food. I think this is an air mask, definitely because it's a hair food. So it's just this mini bottle. I just got all of these things to try it out. Then next thing we have is another one this is a face mask from ayumi brand tea tree face mask i don't really use face masks but it's a green clay with witch hazel as you know most of my um most of my skincare is basically witch hazel so i got this one it has witch hazel moringa and avocado oils so this is just that for this one just this my mini bottle i just want to try it out and i don't really like using a whole lot of these on my face on my skin because i don't have a problematic skin which i'm grateful for and the next thing we have is this peep and pot dragon fruit face scrub i don't know if you guys can see but this is what it looks like it comes it comes in this it comes in this that's why it's a light, it's kind of washing it out, and that's just there. And this is what it looks like. It smells good. Oh my god, I don't know how to show you guys. Okay, that's what it looks like inside. It has like seeds in it, so that's just this bad boy here. Then the next thing we have yet but i don't know but it's just this conditioner i'm gonna read it properly it's from the revolution air care in london deeply condition my curls nourishing conditioner i don't know if it's rinse off but basically this is just there so, we're almost done the next one is hand cream you can never go wrong with hand cream especially in the winter the dry ash things i got eyebrow pencils because i use eyebrow pencils and then this is mm, a multi doc from dr popper it's a multi purple suiting balm with natural purple for lips skin hair beauty blah 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 so this is just this one and i got tiger razor blade so that's all of the good things i got from the beauty store okay no? <laughs> okay from the beauty store i also got my hair gel for my edges because this is one thing that i've noticed that actually holds my edges down the rest the remaining gels you don't do nothing i got it for three pound fifty then i also got this bad boy living conditioner another relieving conditioner is this merely i don't know how to pronounce it merely living conditioner i already have the oil so i decided to just get the living conditioner to use alongside the oil then the next thing is Oh, okay. I actually got the shampoo. <laughs> I thought I didn't buy. I think I got it from a different store. Yeah, I got it from a different store. Cause look at the label on this one, the price tag on this one, and the price tag on this one. They're two different ones. It's just a shampoo, same one I was using before. Of this one, as I am brand. That's just them. It's really good. It has enough mint and all of that goodness. So the last thing. I got from the beauty store is a drag i got a black one i have the wine one in russia me being me i literally almost always wear 
um, during especially when I don't have my hair done. When I decided to get a black one, I would basically go with literally everything rather than me picking and choosing what I can wear with my wine durag. So that's that for this one. Then the next item we're going to the next brand we're gonna jump into is Crocs. I got this, I ordered it from Crocs website, they shipped it from somewhere in Europe. I already opened it. But I got it in this okay, I think I have to bring it out. Okay, I got it in this banana colour. Is the classic platform clothes i got it in a size uk9 because i wanted to get something oversized one thing about crocs is that when you first get them they're always quite tight and all that and i'm not i don't want to go to that process so i went up a size and i got it in a size 9 and i'm trying to bring it out okay and this is the color it's in this banana color i actually really do love it and this is it it's different from the one i have this is like a platform one. it has heels on it so this is just it this one's all right but yeah like i said i got it in the uk nine i got it i had to ship it took about almost two weeks for it to be shipped here so this is it you can always get it in store i'll try to leave the link in the description box for you guys so this is just it. i also got a giblet i don't know where it is i think i kept this on because it's actually so tiny I got a white one that has like a stethoscope on it. If I say it, I put up a picture or I basically check online to show you guys what it looks like. So the last item for this haul, God, this is a huge haul. This is actually a collective haul. I just decided to like break it into parts. So the next collective haul would have all of the schemes, Victoria's Secret and the other items primer and all that all that all that so so the last item is from well, let me show my address from google man so we're just gonna open it okay just gonna open it actually really 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 looking forward to this item I saw it on an influencer on IG and I just had to get it for myself. It's just this a neat wear, it's immense. I got it in the size large. I wanted to get a look extra large, but it's also large. So I had to get large. But so then it's also in size, it's also in immense, in immense. So thank God I fit okay. Thank God I got large because if I got all extra large, it would have been too big because I mean the shirt is normally oversized so this is what it looks like i already have a blue pant that i can wear it with so if i want to like pick out the blue i can wear it with a blue pant pick out the white i can wear it with a white pant the white skirt or a yellow pant or yellow. I, don't, I don't think i have a yellow skirt i can wear this with my baby i can wear this my blue pants yellow crocs and i think i have a yellow bag yeah i have a yellow bag in russia even the yellow ears so this is just what it looks like it's really big i'm happy i got the size large because damn it's so big and i'm i can't wait to style this thank god we're already transitioning into winter because it's neat it's quite thick too i think you know on sales i got it for 19 pounds or 17 pounds it's the shorts sleeve box it's with very crochet polo blue large from boohoo man and that's so basically that. guys that concludes part one of my collective haul all of the things i got from the beauty shop from sarah and boohoo and all that all that all that my hair is rough i'm stressed concludes this video i'm trying to see in case if i didn't miss anything but i think that's all of it that's all of the items in this haul I hope you guys enjoyed it it's quite long that's why I tried rushing through it as fast as possible I actually didn't even know it was this long but yes guys let me know what your favorite item was I think my favorite item my crocs I actually really do love it all of the items I got from Zara I really do love it my boohoo shirt I love it and all of the beauty supply stores I got all of the beauty supplies that I got I actually really really do like it because it's not something I can easily get in Russia I really like the fact that it's black girl hair friendly so I'll see you guys in my next video. Stay happy, stay safe. Until next time.